Hi, my name's Paul. Welcome once again to another short video in a series of useful Chrome extensions. Um, today, I'm going to talk about Pixel Zoom. It's a very simple one. doesn't do a great deal, but it's quite handy for web designers, layouts, and uh, just generally trying to capture the size of an image on the screen or an area between images. So, how does it work? So, I've pulled up um, the Wix website here just to have something to work on. And I'm going to press the um, Pixel Zoomer icon at the top of it. It's a little black square with a picture of magnifying glass there. So what it's done is it's taken a copy of the screen and now I can do things with it. So if I want to have a real close up look at something, I can set the zoom manually. Um, I can zoom out manually by pressing, clicking, sorry, the little negative minus sign magnifying glass. But if I want to actually look at the size of something on the screen, what I can do is click the selection area there so let's say I wanted to find out the exact size of this box. So I'm just going to line my cursor there, drag down to about there. Now I haven't done this particularly accurately. Now if you zoom right in close, you can see better if your selection is good or not. I selected the little hand symbol there because that allows you to drag. So I'm going to go back up and I'm going to just move that to the corner there. So that's by selecting the crosshair symbol there. Um, and then you can see exact, I'm just gonna zoom out again now so you can see what I'm looking at. Click the hand symbol to just drag the whole thing back into the middle of the screen. Um, click that there so I can just resize there slightly. Nope, that didn't work as I thought it was. I actually need to select the area again, like that. But as you can see, up in the kind of toolbar at the top here, it shows you the width and height in pixels. It's also got an eyedropper um, function built in, but I've used other tools which I think are a bit better. This is very rudimentary. It just, as you click around the screen, it just shows you the color here. So it's quite useful, but things like Site Palette and other tools I find uh, more useful. So that's it. It doesn't do a great deal, but it's quite handy for measuring um, parts of the screen. Hope that was useful. Um, please like and share and subscribe to the channel if you found it of value. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much.